application still applies today, even with the express entry. But there's a fine difference, so I wanted to quickly explain that. With any application for permanent residency under the economic class, we first have to apply under the new system called the express entry. I've done many videos on this, so you can definitely check those out, but just for this video particularly, the express entry goes through a two-step process. The first step is to upload all your information on an online pro portal where the Government of Canada looks at your application and basically decides amongst a pool of candidates which candidate they want to continue with their PR application. So essentially you'll get an invitation saying yes, your congratulations, you've been invited to continue your permanent residency. In that letter, the Government of Canada will outline under what category they want you to apply, whether it being the Canadian Experience class or the Federal Skilled. Let's assume that you get a letter that says the Federal Skilled application. What there's a lot of confusion about is, is there a list of occupation now? And essentially, the, you will have to ensure that when you get that letter, your occupation needs to be under NOC A, B, or O. That's really what the Government of Canada is looking for. So again, focus on the express entry portal, because that's really important for you to get that invitation to continue under the Federal Skilled. Obviously, if you've been invited to continue, the Government of Canada has decided that your occupation, your work experience in the last 10 years is something that, the, that Canada needs. So if you're looking at uploading your information under the express entry or you've been invited to continue the permanent residency, both these steps are extremely important for you to be granted the final permanent residence card. If you're looking at filing your PR application, give us a call today. We're here to help. Thank you. Until next time.